What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Dave's Dungeon. I'm your host, Dungeon Master Dave. We're back with another episode of Sekiro. Now, I'm not a hundred percent yet, uh, so you have to forgive me. I'm gonna be a little down in the dumps. Uh, but we're still gonna try and make this a fun playthrough. Still gonna try and push things along and get things done. I just didn't want to leave you guys without an episode for so long. Um, my wife and I did put together an episode of Bloodstained, um, which working with her was a lot of fun. Uh, we're going to continue that series over the weekends, so that's something to look forward to. Uh, but right now, I just want to plug along with Sekiro and figure this out and see what we're supposed to do next. So, we've saved Sekiro from the owl. To see that you are safe. So, and we're just going to be seeing I what's going him. on. I am sorry. Lord Kuro. I am sorry. I did what had to be done. Wolf, thank you. Yeah, man, we My just, father, we had to get him out of here. was in his possession. This branch, it's from the Everblossom tree? Yeah, I man. See. So, Al has. He's yes. the one that messed it up for everybody. To the fountainhead incense. Yes. Yes. That's right, Wolf. I must remain vigilant. Wolf, I've made progress. I'm sure this is the last ingredient for the aroma. What is it? The blood of the divine heir of the dragon's heritage. Your blood, but my lord. Yes. It is true that those of the dragon's heritage... We gotta cut him with the mortal blade. In Lord Genichiro's quarters, I found a curious journal belong... And it appears there is a way for me. For now, I'd like to ask... Now then, we just need to figure out how to make me bleed. Hmm. Perhaps we should ask Lady Emma. As a doctor, she should have much knowledge of the human body. Yes, she may be able to help us. Let's talk to Emma. There is something I'd like to ask. Yes, what is it? Can the divine heir be made to bleed? Why would you seek to do so? The blood of the divine heir is required to obtain the dragon tears from the divine realm and achieve immortal severance. Oh, I see. It is true that the divine heir's blood cannot be shed by normal means. But let me However, guess. You currently possess the means to do so. The mortal blade. Yes. Here you yep. are. With mortal blade in hand, my blood may be shed. Okay. This was written by Lord Takeru? It was. With the mortal blade, you may wound the divine heir, and his blood will be allowed to flow. I see. Hmm. This brings us one step closer to immortal severance. I shall tell my lord. Of course. As I told the mortal. Yes, I shall. Of course. Master Wolf, it looks your. Hmm. Please. Master Wolf, it your. Hmm. Please. See that Lord Kuro's wish to sever immortality. Goodbye. You don't seem too happy about that, though. Something. It's a stone. A stone? Yes. A stone enshrined in a village within the depths of Ashina. One must throw oneself for it to be found. With this, the fountainhead fragrance is complete. complete. What is. Mm. Mm. What, is huh? what is that strangely shaped rock you hold? Is I that found it. The fragrant stone of the fountainhead? My lord, this stone appears. Yes. Yes. There was also an inscription, a sweetly scented bridal offering written hmm. on the altar. Bridal? Hmm. What sort of place was this? It was in a cave beyond a door made of solid rock. Hmm. In that case, where was the wedding procession headed? No way to know, I guess. Sweetly scented. Hmm? Lord Kuro. That place might be the gateway to the divine realm. Hmm. I see. Sweetly scented. Meaning, wrapped in the fountainhead incense. That is what it might be referring to. Okay. My lord, I've procured... 
secured the flower for the fountainhead. Yeah, we had to kill oh? a monkey for Was it. it. Truly blooming in the sunken valley? Yes. Deep within the valley. So that is where the fountainhead waters pool deeply. You've done well to acquire this wolf. Wolf, did you speak with Lady Emma? I did. Yep. And what did she say? That it could be possible with the mortal blade. I see. So the mortal blade will allow my blood to flow. As you wish. This should be all of the necessary ingredients for the aroma. Wolf, burn the incense. As you wish. Okay. Emma hasn't moved. Let's make sure we haven't. I'm glad you. Master Wolf, it looks more complete. Okay, so she's still just Goodbye. talking about we're happier. All right, putting everything in the encanter. My lord. Wolf, the mortal blade. <clears throat> Fear not. I will only make a shallow cut. Would you draw the mortal blade from its sheath? Yes, my lord. Forgive me, but close your eyes. Yes, my lord. Ah. Was the wound I'm fine I just made a small cut on my chest oh so this is the fountainhead incense it's so extraordinarily nostalgic I see it glows do you notice anything different the aroma and fountainhead palace those words have been burned into my mind fountainhead palace it's just as Lord Takeru wrote. That place must lead to the divine realm. But how can the Fountainhead Palace be reached? A sweetly scented bridal offering that was written on the altar where the fragrant stone was placed. Yes. Hmm. You now carry the aroma of the Fountainhead incense. I believe the path leading to the Fountainhead Palace will open before you if you go to the shrine within the cave. Immortality shall soon be severed. I'm counting on you, Wolf. As you wish. Okay, so we have to go back to the cave. Let's... I just want to rest up now that we've done that. Maybe that's changed some stuff around. Maybe now... I'm glad you... Master Wolf, it looks your place. Huh. Goodbye. Oh, cool. I, to you. I will obtain them. Yes. He gives me some more. Wolf. I yes. You must first. You now. I believe that. As you would. All right. Let's make sure. Wolf. Yes. You. you I believe. As you. All right. So he didn't have any new dialogue. Let's. We're almost there. Yes. Do what must be done. Okay. Okay, so he's he's resolved himself to that. I'm glad. Goodbye. Let's see. I don't know. I feel like there's got to be more to this. Aha. So she does have something to say. I must do what must be done. <laughs> that is what the diviner said. He must be hiding something. I see. Uh, what is it? Lord Takeru spoke of beheading in his memory. Yeah, I don't want to cut the Lord's yes. head off. Perhaps this doesn't seem like a good idea. Was the means to end immortality, along with the life of the divine heir. What? If you walk the path of immortal severance, then you must use the mortal blade to end my lord's life. No, yes, we're not doing that. Lord Kuro desires immortal severance. I understand that. I do. And yet, Master Wolf, might there be a path where Lord Kuro need not lose his life? Oh, do tell. The dragon's heritage is no ordinary power. There could be such a path. Well then, Master Wolf. 
I ask that you help me find such a path. A path where Lord Kuro need not die. I will not let my lord die. Yeah, we're gonna Thank save him. You. We must find a starting point. Yes. <sighs> oh. Yes. Lady Tomoy's. Master Wolf, I might have a place. I'll look into it and let you know. Thank you. Also. Keep this. Yes. Yeah, we ain't telling him because he just wants to die. Um, check over here with Ishin. Make sure we haven't missed nothing. So, apparently, there's a second mortal blade. Um, and apparently, some other stuff's gonna go down. I don't know when, I don't know where, but uh, apparently, probably Genichiro, uh, Genichiro has the second mortal blade. Master will all look into it. Thank you. Also, keep this. Yeah. Yeah. Lord Bao, my wish he could be freed of this. That is all. Yeah, me Lord too. Bao, he, that is all. All right. No more cord seeds to give you right now. Alright, she's still standing there. I think I got all the dialogue done. I think I got all that done. Let's, uh, you know, someone we haven't checked on in a while. Let's go see what's going on at the Inner Sanctum. Divine child of the rejuvenating waters. We need to go check on our other immortal child. And then uh, Seki Joe. We need to go check on him. Ooh. What's up, girl? No. Oh. How are you? Shinobi of the Divine Air? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Your eyes. Uh, you have returned. Shinobi of the Divine Air, it appears I have succeeded in becoming the Cradle. Oh, cool. Could you please take my hand? Yes. Yeah. What? It is cold, much like an ice house, which is why, see? My tears, they freeze as they flow down my face. These frozen tears, take them. Oh. By having Kuro drink both the Dragon Tears and Frozen Tears, the Cradling Ritual can be performed. Cold Dragon Tears are just frozen that. Tears. Does this mean... Yes, I believe this is what the text referred to as Cold Dragon Tears. Oh. The Divine Air must drink them together with the Dragon Tears of the Divine Realm. If he does so, I believe Lord Kuro will be able to rest within the Cradle. Ooh. Shinobi, what would you ask of me? If you wish to return the dragon's heritage to its... He only needs but to drink. Shinobi, please search. <laughs> what is it? Hold out your... All right. Bless us with... This is... It's cold. With my body so cold, the... It's like... <laughs> then that is what Shinobi of the Divine Air... Fine snow. Cool. Okay, so she's better. Kuro seems to be okay. Um, I still got two persimmons. Fine snow. Sweet rice ball. Divine grass. I got so many healing items. That's all gonna be helpful. Alright, so let's... I did a little bit uh, to unlock this place again and clean some stuff out. We still got one headless to fight. 
so I won't do that off camera without you guys. Um, we've checked out Lord Cora's room. I guess we could check out the old grave. Maybe, maybe something happens there. Because I got a feeling there's more for me to do for this quest. It's not over yet. It. We gotten frozen tears. We've gotten ever blossom. I feel like there's something else, someplace else we'll have to go to figure out the rest of this. Cause um there's gotta be more to this. It can't just be done. Nope, no one here. Okay, so eventually something's supposed to happen here. I don't know what. Maybe... Let's check the dilapidated temple. Because we gotta check on Sucky Joe. I don't know. I don't know where to go right this second. I don't necessarily need to go straight to the Fountainhead Palace just yet. Yeah, no, nope, nothing changed here. Hmm. Let's just go back to Kuro's room. Maybe there's, I don't know, there's got to be something else going on. I feel like I'm missing dialogue or something. Hmm. <sighs> Cause I'm looking I don't know I don't want to sever him I don't want to I don't want to be responsible for killing my lord oh I don't want to do it <laughs> evil Dave would do it without hesitation but not me <sighs> wolf I yes you must first you now can I believe as you wish anything else <sighs> Let's go talk to Emma again. Master, I found Oh, you found something. Lord Takeru coughs are worsening still. Return to the divine realm is hopeless. And I only wish to sever the dragon's heritage and restore his humanity. It requires the ever blossom and mortal blade, yet I can't acquire the latter. It was hidden by the high priest of Sempo Temple. Has no desire. It says here there is a way to cut the ties of the dragon's blood and transform its owner into a regular human being. The process requires a flower from the ever blossom, as I told you once before. The tree the was ever destroyed. Is a sakura tree that Lord Takeru brought here from the divine realm. However, someone cut a branch from the tree. And stole the flowers, and the ever blossom eventually dried and withered away. So the ever blossom tree has. Been if the tree itself no longer flowers, don't exist. Correct, but the branch that was stolen. So if it could. Is this the branch it was? Master Owl, but there are no flowers. Hmm. What's wrong? It's not. I was just trying to remember back to when the ever blossom. Try as I might. Their graves. What? I think I'll pay a visit to Lord Takeru and Lady Tomoe's uh, graves. That's where the ever something might come. So this is where we gotta go to the old graves. Okay, 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 okay. So I'm trying to get a specific ending. I've shown you guys the Ashura ending. I don't want to show you the severance or the purification ending. I want to show you guys a really secret one called the purification. All this it may help. By the way, how return. Goodbye. So we're going to go to the old grave. See what's going on there. <sighs> Sorry if I'm not real talkative this time. Again, I'm still trying to get my health back 
and I'm still feeling like, I don't know, him or dog crap, <laughs> to be frank. I still feel like I've been hit with a Mack truck, and I still got more stuff to do. So, we're going to just, I'm going to do the best I can with this. Lady. Why must that be the only way? Hello. Uh, Master Wolf, how long have you been there? Have you remembered anything? Two seconds. Uh, nothing, I'm afraid. Nothing? That's right. I'm sorry. I wasn't able to remember anything significant. Really? Perhaps one of my old friends can help. Ooh. I'll meet with Orangutan at his temple. Orangutan? Yes. It's the sculptor's old nickname. Seki Joe. So we're one-armed wolf. Sekiro. So Seki Joe, which we found out is from Hambe, that that's the name of the old sculptor. Seki Joe must be one armed orangutan. So let's go on back to the updated temple. And I'm starting to remember you gotta make sure that you're eavesdropping on everybody. So if she's back here with him, we'll make sure we eavesdrop. And I just been getting stuff from the divine air uh, of the rejuvenating waters uh, throughout the game. And one time she asked me for the snake carts. So one time I gave them to her and then it kind of threw her into the room all quiet by herself. Hmm. Well, we kind of figured that was going to happen, and we don't necessarily want to be severed. Sculptor. What? Need something? I've abandoned the pit. I, I never. Okay. Say. What? Did you know this temple is horrible? Sure it is. Yeah, I was listening. What of it? Oh, you're here, Master. Was the sculptor able to help? Unfortunately, no. I'm afraid. <sighs> Don't lie to me, girl. What did that mean? Were you listening this whole time? Tell me. Uh, Orangutan I heard. That day beneath the branches of the ever blossom tree, Lady Tomoe tried to commit suicide. Why? She said. Those made immortal by the oath of the dragon's heritage shackle their masters. So in order for the purification to occur, the oath bound of the dragon's heritage must die? Yes, precisely. Oh, let's hope he hasn't she made anybody else immortal. Correct. She did not have the mortal blade. Hmm. I don't want to lose Lord Kuro or you. But all paths Aww. are leading to dead ends. Haha, <laughs> boo doo 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 bonk. What are you hiding? Dead ends, get it? She's so very so punny. You overheard. Tell me. Do what must be done. I will live by those words, as my master does. Here. So we're kind of. We're kind of. We've kind of told him do what must be done. He's kind of believing that. And now we're kind of believing that. Uh, we're not guiding. We're not living under guidance of our master. Our master's living under guidance of old us. And we're living under guidance of new master. Uh, it's a bit like the ball philosophy. Is this a bell? It fell off Owl's dead body, if I'm not mistaken. You and Master Ooh. Owl have a deep connection. Should you offer it to Buddha, it may be a different experience than the one you had before. I will try it. I am not sure what memories you will see, 
but the bell belonged to Master Owl. So please. So it's probably Take closer care. to the truth than what we got from Granny. Goodbye, Master Wolf. Yay. Sculpt what? Why are you so cranky, dude? Another owl. You go from being all cranky to all nice. I don't get you. <sighs> okay. So, let's check out this bell. And we made sure we finished up old Hirata. So I guess we'll just have to see what's going on. Oh. Alright, so we're back at Hirata Estates outside the burning place. Oh. No, no more dogs. Great, more dogs. Ah, <laughs> great. Exactly one thing I didn't want to happen. Why? Get that Mercury in there. <laughs> Good thing we got three reses now. No. A yow. No. No more. Doggos for you. All right, so that's one down. Let's get him again. Get that McCary. Ouch. Never seen him throw that before. No, not dogs. Dang it. Oh, great. Yeah, I'm outside. God dang it. Last resurrection. Oh, we're out of those? Dang it. Oh, this is a problem. Wait, can we use the Tonto? Here, Tonto. Uh, 
Alright, whoa, whoa. Alright, we're healed back up. Hey yo. Got that parry. God, it's taking a lot. Mm -hmm. Ain't got much left in the healing jug. Get it. Yes. <sighs> All right. That's that's done. Oh, and I think that's all the time we got for this episode. Oh, excuse me. Sorry if I seem a little down. I'm still recovering from being sick. So I'm gonna play. I'm gonna do what I can, but commentary may suck for a couple episodes. So just bear with me. Anyways, thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed this episode if you would leave me a like make sure that you're subscribed make sure you should rung the bell so you get all of our notifications when we're going to record and when we post new episodes again i'm dungeon master dave i thank you so much for watching dungeon dwellers i'll see you in our next adventures till then